Hello and welcome to becomeamusicteacher.com. I'm going to show you today how you subscribe to become a music tutor. Quite easy to do. Open up your web browser. We have Internet Explorer here. And type in become a music teacher.com into your page finder. Go off and find the main page. Okay, so on the main page you have the information here. Uh, about uh, all the different packages that we do, the bronze, the silver and the gold package and if you want to see the full list then obviously click on the full list section at the bottom. Okay so the next thing to do is determine what type of instrument you want to start teaching. Uh, I would select become a music teacher at the top, gives you a drop down box and then you can select guitar, keyboards, piano and the drums. We're going to look at uh, the guitar, but it's exactly the same principle to do each one of the different musical instruments. So click on the one that you want and it will send you into your login page. Okay, so signing up. We're going to sign up today um, as uh, Joe Blogs. Let's just do that. Joe Blogs. And we're going to add a password to it. And we're going to put in our email address. We're going to make one up for this particular demonstration. I haven't just about got my work, but that, that's fine. Okay, terms and conditions there, which you can see the full terms and conditions by clicking on the red uh, read the full terms and conditions at the bottom of the screen. Okay, submit that. It will then take you through to the next page, which is your account sign up page. What you'll need to do is that you want to create your page. So you click on the box there and it will take you through to the page creation. So the first thing to do is assign yourself an email prefix. Uh, you'll be given a postfix on there so we'll stick in a prefix. There we go. And we want to tell the system now all of your details. So we'll click on your details, takes you through to the next page and then if you can put in your information such as your telephone number at the top I stick in uh, one high street in there. Uh, city, let's go for Fender. County, let's go for Gibson. I'm sure you've heard all these before. And your postcode in there. Uh, 3351B in there. And your country. In there. Okay, at the bottom there's a section about CRB. That's only applicable if you are in the UK. If you have a certificate, which um, I do, uh, then click on that you do. If you don't, then click on that you don't. Next, you go on to your page information section. This is where you're going to give a bit more information about your teaching on there. So at the top, you want your your, your name is always the preferable thing to stick on there. And then some information in the page description, so you can think of things like how long you've played the instrument for, if you have any teaching or music qualifications around that particular instrument, whether you teach from home or mobile, and you can get a list of all the things within the box there, or you type in your information within the box. Okay, social media links is the next part we want to do. It's where we upload things like pictures and, and so on to your profile. Uh, if you've got a Facebook uh, profile and it is appropriate for you to use on a guitar teaching uh, profile, then stick your URL in there. Make sure you put the HTTP colon forward slash forward slash in there before the website address. You can go through all of those, sticking your YouTube in there, YouTube video and so on. Uh, if you haven't got those, you can always come back to this at a later date and input them in from there. Your images and music are next, so we can go off and find ourselves an image for our profile. So let's go and find one there. There we go. And we can add up to five uh, photos of us with a, a, a title image on there as well. MP3s, anything up to 8 meg we can have on there. So let's stick an MP3 in from there on. And again, terms and conditions, you can read all about them by clicking on there. Once you've done that, click on create your page. What it then does is upload your information, so it can take a few seconds to minutes, depending on how large the files are and how fast your, your broadband connection is. 
Okay, so this part is where you actually pay for your subscription. Uh, depending on who you are, then either select new subscription if it's totally new, a renewal if you've already got a um, subscription with us, or if you have a code for become a music teacher, this is where you want to click the other and you enter your code reference into the box at the bottom. Okay, now that isn't a applicable code so it won't actually work, so I'll just go to new subscription for now. And it will take you then through to the page where you designate which one of the services. Remember me talking about the bronze, silver, and gold at uh, the the start. So you can select each one of the, one of the packages that you want to go for. Um, once you've done that, you then click on the pay section. This will then take you through to our PayPal uh, page, and you can put your uh, PayPal details in there. Sign into them. It will then set up your your payment. Any problems at all, then check out our website, becomeamusicteacher.com, or get in touch uh, with us through the website. Thank you.